Hi everyone, it's Shannon and welcome to today's video. So today's video, very excited to do because I have some of the Charlotte Tilbury new products. So first up, I have her brand new, it is the uh, Pillow Talk Big Lip Plumpgasm and then the brand new um, Pillow Talk Fair. So I recently did a video swatching all of my kissing formula lipsticks from Charlotte Tilbury and I mentioned that they were coming out with Pillow Talk Fair and I assumed that it was going to be Matt Revolution because all um, the other two Pillow Talk and Pillow Talk Medium are in Matte Revolution. So I assume this one was. Someone commented, no, it's going to be kissing. So of course, um, I already am missing one uh, lipstick in that video. But uh, I did pick it up. I was very excited. And actually, I was very happy that it was in the kissing formula. But I have that. So this is the Pillow Talk Fair. Um, and then we have this new, you know, plumping lip gloss and uh, it only comes in two shades which I was thankful about I did not receive these in PR I did purchase these, these myself sometimes I get PR sometimes I don't so I did purchase these myself and um, these are the uh, <laughs> they are big um, so these are the plumping lip glosses and as a comparison you can see this is the pillow talk fair so that is the comparison now they did come out with three new shades of the collagen lip bath um, in like different shades of Pillow Talk. And then they also restocked the Pillow Talk um, highlighter and they changed the cover. Now mine shattered and I salvaged it. I kind of just, you know, it's all, it's kind of like a really glossy, you know, shiny blush, but um, I probably will pick it up, but I just, I don't need another highlighter right now. So I'm trying to see if I can resist it. Uh, I did review it, so I know it's fantastic, um, but it is very expensive and I have a lot of highlighters. So, but if you were one that wanted it, it is available now on Charlotte Tilbury. And I don't know if it's going to be permanent. It doesn't say if it's limited edition or permanent. So I'm going to assume it's going to be limited edition because it was so popular, but you know, um, hopefully, hopefully I can resist, but I, I think I'll eventually pick it up maybe during a sale, but we're going to go over these and then, but first we're going to go over the pillow talk fair. So I'm going to start with this one because I don't want these glosses to affect the, um, the look of the pillow talk fair. But if you watched my video on the kissing formula, I talked about the kissing formula there. It is a very comfortable formula. It's actually a very long lasting formula. It is, um, you know, just very, um, moisturizing I guess you could say but it doesn't it's not too shiny it's a perfect amount of shine but it is very 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 long lasting I do like the matte revolution a little bit more because it does last a little bit longer but for a you know a satin lipstick this formula is fantastic so if you want more information on the actual you know kissing formula you can go back to that video I'll post it here I swatch all 25 of my shades so now I have 26 and now we're gonna try this one now this one is described as a cool toned pink and if you ever try the original pillow talk it is more peachy you don't really see that it's peachy until you you know compare it to this one which is cool tone now I am more neutral leaning warm so I tend to like more warm so uh, I haven't tried this one I have swatched it but that's it um, but I do love the original pillow talk I wear it a lot um, I also wear Rocket Girl a lot, which is very similar to Pillow Talk as well. So what I did, since I didn't include this one in my original Kissing fil uh, Formula video, um, I went ahead and just kind of looked at all my Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks and swatched the ones that I thought were the closest and then uh, photographed it in sunlight. So uh, here's the photo and here we're gonna go um, left to right. And first we have Pillow Talk Fair, which is a cool tone pink. Icon Baby, which is a warm warm nude rose, JK Magic, a rose peachy nude, red carpet pink, pastel pink, candy chic, candy pink, famously pink, which is a coral pink, angel Alessandra, a nude, dance floor princess, a pop pink, Penelope pink, a nude with pink undertones, in love with Olivia pink, chic pink, which is blush pink, Rocket Girl, which is a cool nudie pink, and then Pillow Talk, which is a nude pink. And then the last one there is also Pillow Talk Fair, which is a cool toned pink. So that way you have a side-by-side -side of the original Pillow Talk and the Pillow Talk Fair. So if you look at those, um, these, this is definitely one of the 
more cool toned pinks except with the exception of the three new um ones that i just swatched the icon icon baby uh red carpet pink and candy chic it's very similar to those because it's cool toned i think it's very similar to the icon baby except the icon baby is a little bit deeper and it also has those glitter particles so if you don't like the glitter particles then you might like this one but compared to the pillow talk it is definitely you know much more cool toned and then also it is a different formula so you know really depends on what you you know wants or needs are okay so i'm just going to i don't have any liner on i'm just going to go ahead and apply this and okay so here is pillow talk fair and it's definitely fairer than the um you know original pillow talk i do really like it now again i've talked about that i do gravitate more towards um you know warm tones so i like it and i think it's really pretty um it's a really pretty light pink i think it's going to be really pretty with like a smoky eye or if you you know just like more of a satin or you like more cool tones so really pretty i'm glad they came out with this again i'm glad they came out with it in a different formula so this is pillow talk fair Okay, so now we're going to talk about this new Big Lip Plump uh, Gasm. Again, only comes in two shades. And so reading from the website, it says, discover my new Pillow Talk Big Lip Plump Gasm, a lip plumping lip gloss to supersize and maximize. Just pump, plump, and pout for big lips. Available in two universal, universally flattering shades. Fair Medium is a pink nude and Medium Deep is a brown berry pink. Glide on and feel the sensation of plump plumpgasm work its magic giving you fullness from first touch it's my lip amplifying secret for a juicy plumped up pout in seconds the plumping effect does not stop there the more you wear it the more your natural lips look plumper and smoother it's enriched with plumpgasm heat and ice technology plump effect collagenier and hydrating hyaluronic acid the formula combines the hydrating comfort of a balm plus the amplifying power power of a lip plumper with the beautifying pretty pink pillow talk effect so your lips look plumper and smoother and it also does the dishes in the laundry i mean typical charlotte tilbury it does everything now i don't you know when i get something like this i'm not expecting like it to you know do long-term effects if it does great but i never really expect that um even if it says it does so i never purchase anything for that reason but you know Typical, I mean, Charlotte Tilbury is a marketing genius, you know, um, so it is what it is. But um, I I would say is like, do you get the immediate effect, the look that you want, then buy it. If you're looking for long-term effects, then I wouldn't, you know, purchase it for that, if that makes sense. But, okay, so let me take off the Pillow Talk Fair and I'm going to put, uh, I'm first gonna put the, me the Fair Medium and I'm gonna leave it on for five minutes to see how it, you know, what uh what it looks like after five minutes of wear and then we'll try the medium deep as well okay so before we go ahead and try them on let me go ahead and do the swatches so this is the fair medium and then here is the medium deep so again this is like a nude pink this is like a berry pink so um you know i think with this one i'm happy to get both so i'm curious to see i think i will probably like them the fair medium more but I'm happy to have gotten both. But let's go ahead and I will try on the fair medium. Okay, so here is the fair medium of the new plumpgasm, whatever it's called, um, big lip plumpgasm. So it has a cooling effect with a tingle. It is pretty intense, but it's not painful i'm not a big limp plumper person so that's why i was glad she only came out with two shades because i really didn't want to purchase more than that but it's really comfortable my favorite lip plumper is by far the city lips one and i would say it feels a little bit more intense than the city lips so uh, i'm going to give it um, five minutes and uh, i will come back and we will see if my lips look any plumper Okay, so I have been wearing this now. It's been about um, seven minutes since I first applied it. And one, it's still tingling. So it is still very much tingly. And it is just to the point where it's a little uncomfortable. Um, it's not, it's, 
it's a little uncomfortable, but it's not to the point where I need to take it off. But it has not started to die down. <laughs> so I will say if you do not like that um, tingle burning sensation, now it's not hot, but it does have kind of like that burning sensation, but with a cooling effect, I would say don't purchase these. However, if you like that, um, it's definitely not uncomfortable completely, but it is kind of in that middle range. You know, there are some like the lip injections that I cannot tolerate. Um, and then there's some that really are very subtle. This one is definitely, definitely a lot more intense than the City Lips, but um, it is, you know, again, just almost to the point where I need to take it off, but I don't. So, but I, I am going to take it off because I'm gonna put on the other one, but this is the Fair Medium. Now, does it make my lips look bigger? I don't think so. I think it does look bigger because of the, the, the gloss. I think the gloss is beautiful. I think the color is gorgeous. I actually really like the gloss and the color. Um, so, but I don't know if they're actually plumping my lips. Uh, I did do a side-by-side -side comparison. So here is the side-by-side -side comparison. Maybe when I'm editing it, I will see the difference, but you tell me if you think that there is a difference in the plumping effect of this. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to take this shade off and we'll come back and we will apply the medium dark. Okay, so now we're gonna do the medium dark one and you can see here. Now the doe foot applicator is really nice because um, it's actually pretty big. So we'll just apply the medium dark now. Okay, and here is the medium dark. So um, I will say as soon as I took it off, the tingling still stayed. <laughs> it wasn't like the tingling went away, it stayed and it didn't get subtle. Um, this one, you know, it, it feels the same, so, but I don't, it didn't like stop. So I guess that doesn't make any sense. But um, anyway, so this is the medium deep. Now I really like this shade as well. I do like that one's like a berry red or a, you know, a berry pink and one's a nude pink. I can see myself wearing both. Um, so I do really like both. Do you need both? No, you know, if you like more of a nude shade or you like more of a deeper shade, but this is one that you could probably sheer out a little bit and um, it would, you know, be really pretty, or you can, you know, make it a little bit deeper just by adding a little bit more and building the color. So this is the medium deep. Okay, so let me give you my final thoughts on everything. So first off, let's talk about the uh, big plump, plump gasm. Um, one, I think the packaging is gorgeous. It's just really bulky. And, you know, I love that Charlotte Tilbury is usually very sleek. These are pretty bulky. So um, that's like, it's just one of those things that I don't really care for. I really like the, you know, the glosses from Give Beauty, but they're so bulky. So I end up not, you know, traveling with them. So, you know, I do like that they have it on the side. I do like the, the shade. So when I look at them, I can tell which one's the light one and which one's the dark one. Um, they are just really bulky, but the packaging is gorgeous like I love I absolutely love the packaging so you know I think if you don't mind bulky packaging um, then you won't mind these however if you like something that's sleek then maybe this isn't for you these are intense though I will say the plumping and the tingle is intense it's tolerable but if you are one that's sensitive to this don't get it it's just gonna be too much. Um, it's definitely, I would say stick with the collagen lip baths. Those are fantastic. Those have like a minty, slight tingle. Um, and honestly, I don't really feel a big plumping effect. Again, I could see it when I do my editing, but you know, there's definitely a tingle. I love the shades though. But if you don't get these, if you, you know, don't, if you don't like a tingle at all, or if you are sensitive to a tingle, because these are pretty, pretty intense, um, but I like them. They're $35 a piece, they're not cheap, so I would say also maybe wait for a sale or use my promo code SHANNONFFA012 that will save you 15% off your first order on charlottetilbury.com. Um, the lipstick, Charlotte, uh, the Pillow Talk Fair, I really like it. I think it's a really pretty color. You know, if you saw my swatchings, um, there's definitely nothing like this as far as a cool tone pink. 
really pretty cool tone pink. Um, I thought, you know, when she came out with those five pink shades, I thought they were really necessary because when I was doing all my swatches, I was realizing, yeah, everything is warm, you know, at the most neutral, but everything is warm leaning, peach leaning. So she was definitely in need of um, some pink, uh, you know, true cool tone pinks, which she came out with. She came out with those five pink shades. And then this one is just a cool toned, basically, I wouldn't say it's more like pillow talk cool rather than pillow talk fair it is a very fair shade but i think it's kind of you know if you really want a description of it it's the pillow talk cool shade so i really like it if you like cool tones and you like the kissing formula i think this is a really good buy um so i think these are great uh you know but i think it's just a matter of you know what do you, what do you want to spend do you like the you know do you like tingle and do you need another charlotte Tilbury lipstick um but you know i I like all three and I would recommend all three, but for the right person. So with that, if you like this video, click like, click and subscribe. That way you get a notification every time I post a new video. Bye everyone.